Hey guys, it's Olivia. Welcome to my channel and welcome back to another vlog. Today, we're doing a day in my life because my life is so exciting that I just had to share it with you guys. I do have a couple things that I need to do today that are kind of... I did make a little teeny tiny bit of a to-do list and I don't have everything that I need on here. So today, it's September 26th. I don't know when you guys are seeing this video, to be honest, because I don't have an upload schedule. I just post whenever I want. But today, we have a bit of a busy day. Um, it's currently 8 a.m. I need to get hair dye because I don't know if you guys can see, but my roots are coming in so hot. Like, that's one thing that we're gonna be doing is later today i'm gonna dye my hair and i'm gonna show you guys what hair dye i use how i do it all of that because i do it all myself we're gonna go on a little barnes trip and the reason for that is because i need to get the rest of the chestnut spring series before the new covers come out because i already have flawless in the old covers i just i can't switch up everything i've literally this has happened the past like i think it's been three or i don't even know how many series it's been but it keeps happening where I will buy one or two of a series and I like it and then it gets announced that they're putting out new covers and then I can't find the old covers anywhere. That happened with Magnolia Parks and it really pisses me off. It's really frustrating to look at my shelves. Flawless is another one that that's happening with. They're, the old covers were like this, now they're coming out like this. And I think that Heartless has already come out like that. I'm not sure, I don't know. So I'm basically gonna go look at what they have available, what they've got and see. Then I have class, which is important. I put online shop here, but that sounds really stupid, but I promise it's not. Well, it is kind of stupid. My version of like window shopping is going onto a website that I like and just adding all the things to my wish list or to my cart or anything like that. So I've done that with a bunch of stores and I just, I want new clothes. So I need to look at that. Um, I just want to look and see what all I've got, what all is kind of just the same across the board. The one thing that I do really need, I have a party this weekend that is Y2K themed and I have nothing in that genre. I don't know if you can tell, but I don't, I dress for comfort, not really fashion. Um, I just like, I just exist. And then I need to finish the rough edit of the week in my life. By the time that you guys are seeing this, it should already be up, but I still have like five and a half hours of footage to get through for that. And I just need to sit my ass down and just work through it. And then the last thing that I wanna do is I wanna figure out Notion because I wanna use Notion so badly, but I cannot figure it out for the life of me. I just, I don't understand how it works. I don't get it. A couple people that I watch on YouTube use Notion and really like it. So, oh, and then speaking of online shopping, I actually posted a poll to my Instagram. So if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, um, but I was asking which Stanley I should buy. I had four options, technically five, but I could only fit four in the poll, so I just put four. The options are pink, light blue, green, or dark blue. So I posted that last night, so I think it's probably been like 12 hours, no, eight hours since I posted that. Ooh, okay, we'll see, we'll, we'll see. I might just, who knows, maybe I'll just feel impulsive and buy more than one. I'm actually sitting outside Walgreens right now, and I'm gonna go run in and grab my hair dye. So I'll probably just film on my phone because I'm not bringing my big ass camera in there. That's stupid. And then I'm gonna go to Starbucks, I think, and just sit and get some work done until Barnes & Noble opens, and then we'll run over there. So it's, I'm tired. Can you tell? Oh, and then another thing, I need to set up my Kindle because I got a bunch of Kindle stickers in the mail so I finally got those, which means that I can decorate my Kindle, and I'm gonna film 
that for you guys obviously but i'm also gonna put that onto my tiktok so that's my little to-do list um and we'll see how much of it I get done. Hopefully a lot of it. Hopefully I I keep thinking of more things that I need to add to it. Like I need to actually put dye my hair on it. I know that if it's not on a list, I won't get it done. So I have to put it on a list because I'm just, I have a goblin brain and nothing gets done if it's not written down. So, all right, we're gonna go grab the things. I've returned. Of course, the one day that I like actually do my hair and actually need it to look good, it's raining. That's really cute. I really appreciate that. Okay, quick little haul. First off, I got two cards. One is for Leah, one is for my stepdad. I didn't actually open either of these. This is for his birthday. I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't that. Yay. So we've got that one. Um, <clears throat> and then for Leah, this one, it says, witching you weren't so far away. I don't know, I just thought it's funny because we're long distance friends, but she's coming to visit me because she loves me. I got my hair dye, this is the one I use. This is in the shade 7.45 Intense Fire Ruby. And then I got the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. This one is always out near me, and so seeing it in stock, I'm like, I grabbed these hair clips for the Y2K party. I don't know if these are Y2K, but they are now. A native body wash. This one's coconut and vanilla. I don't know, but I've heard good things about native products, and I wanted to try it. I also got this Celsius. This one is the sparkling orange. It's the only one that they had. My friend read um, Akatar, and she's giving me her review. Also, is it normal to think this relationship between Feyre and Tamlin isn't gonna work out? Cause like, I'm highly questioning it. Maybe I just, <laughs> it's getting a little too good to be true feeling that I'm getting. Not that I ship them all that much. Oh, I can't say anything. She has zero, like no idea how the story's gonna go or the fact that people call him tampon or the fact that we all hate him. I'm gonna just lie. No, he's great. Don't worry. I wish that I didn't know about how it goes. It was so well known that I knew everything, so I have no idea how she hasn't had anything spoiled for her, but I'm happy for her and not at all jealous. Buckle up, besties. I'm gonna go drive to Starbucks and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Maybe if I put my fucking key... I'm an idiot. Jesus Christ, Olivia. Okay, it's a lot later now. It is 10.30 on the dot. 10.31 as soon as I showed it. Of course that happened. I need to go to Barnes & Noble really quick because I have class at noon. Starbucks drink of the day. I actually haven't had any of it yet. I was hard at work. This is an iced chai with pumpkin and cream cold foam, so. It's very good. I would recommend if you get it, get extra pumpkin like spice topping because it's so good. I forgot what I was looking for. I 
I went not off script, a little, a little off script, but it's okay. I was going there for the vibes. First up, what we came in for, we got Arch Enemies by Marissa Meyer. I really love Marissa Meyer's writing. I read the Lunar Chronicles a long time ago and I loved it. It was what kept me reading for so long. Um, I remember sitting in fifth grade, hunched over a book. I just opened something and almost spoiled something. Then, while I was also in the young adult fantasy section, I saw The Prison Healer by Lynette Noni. As we saw, they didn't have the old covers, which I hate when places do that. Not that when they change the covers, because like, fine, whatever. Yes, it's frustrating, but it is it is what it is. But whenever they get rid of the entire series, like right now, they just have these two out, even though the books have been published for a while. We got the first two, we got Flawless, which I already have, but it's fine. And then we got Heartless, and this is the second book in the series. This one follows Rhett and Summer, and then this one I think follows Cade, Rhett's brother, and then Willa, Summer's best friend. We didn't really see them interact at all, and I like in companion novels like this, when you see the interaction beforehand, before they kind of get together. Like in the Twisted series, we saw little bits of Bridget and Reese, and we saw Josh and Jules. And then lastly, this is a new release. This is Wildfire by Hannah Grace. I actually haven't read Icebreaker yet. I do have it and I do want to read it, but I haven't read it yet. But this is the second in the Maple Hills. I don't know if you have to read the others. Oh, the dedication is so sad for younger me who wanted to be his first choice. That's heartbreaking. Will you call me baby? All of the girls. But I love you more when I think of all the make. I made it to campus, so I should probably hurry up and like walk over to class. But I just don't want to. This happens every time. That's a little concerning. Do I like have a personality? Like I don't want to have responsibilities anymore. I'm tired of it. Okay. Bye-bye. <sighs> oh, hey guys. It's been so long. No, it hasn't. No, it hasn't. <sighs> My class was canceled, and I'm not I'm not angry that the class was canceled. I'm angry that I didn't check my email because this happened last week where I went all the way to class, all the way on campus, and then I walked in and they were like, yeah, class is canceled. And I was like, God damn it. I should know better. I should know to check my email, but I don't. I don't. I'm pissed. I'm pissed off. Okay. I'm going to go home, redo my hair because the rain ruined it. There's just no curl anymore. I'm gonna touch up my makeup and then I'm gonna film the video that I need to film. Or at least it's the intro. It's not like the full thing because it's gonna be a reading vlog, but something is choosing my books. I'm, I'm tired. I'm tired. It's a gloomy day out and I'm tired and I want to go home. It's literally not even one o'clock and it's 1243 and I'm exhausted. Hi, I'm home now. I redid my hair so now it's like super curly, so let that fall and settle. But I'm gonna pick out the books for the video that I'm filming, so we need to, we need to actually decide which ones. I want to give as options. Um, I don't know which video's gonna be up first. I'm assuming this one, but basically I've got some options and I'm gonna make something pick. I'm being cryptic because I don't wanna like ruin the surprise, but I'm gonna go switch over to that SD card and then I'll be back. All right. I think that now would be a good time to show you all of the Kindle stickers that I got because it's 5.30 right now. I want to get my Kindle set up. I have this. I got these from all different places. I kept the business cards so that I could tell you guys what they all are. Um, so I'll have them all linked down below in case you were interested in the Etsy shops. There's a lot in here. I think I have like 60 some. This is my Kindle. I got the Kindle Paperwhite 2023 version. It's just the black one. And then I have this Death Star pop socket so that I can hold it more easily. I have all of this stuff 
linked on my reading accessories on my Amazon storefront in case you're ever wondering about it. That's all there. I'm just gonna lay them out here and then show you. I have so many left over, but this is what it is for now. I'll probably switch it out a bajillion times. I put 1989 here because 1989 Taylor's version is coming out soon. And then Harry Styles because I'm in love with him right now. I'm in love with him. Sue me. You can't. I think I'm gonna read some and then I'll probably come back to you guys to talk about some online shopping because now that I've cleaned my room, I really want to buy some things for it. I'll just talk you through it right now. So I have this whole long bookcase and I think I wanna do like two wall posters here and then I think I'm gonna do a third one on that wall right there. I'm gonna look on Etsy. I've already been looking for a couple things, but I'm gonna look some more. But right now I'm gonna read because I do have a project due in a few days. I think it's due next Monday. Monday or Wednesday, we're presenting it. Hey guys, it's a little later. I just finished dinner, did some chores, fun stuff like that, I know. I'm gonna double check my to-do list, let's see. So I still need to shop, edit, and dye my hair. And like, Notion stuff. We're making progress, guys. We are making progress. Let's look at the poll. See, the thing is, it's so close on all of them. It's 32, guys originally this video was just gonna be one day it was just gonna be yesterday it's the light coming through here but i didn't end the video yesterday and i'm going to pick up a couple things so i thought that i would bring you guys with me i need to go pick up something at dick's i might go to crumble they're having their like six pack for four cost or price today but i haven't decided and then there's also a barnes and noble over where the dicks is so i think i'm gonna go there my hair is very very vibrant today so if that's giving you a headache just give me a few days it'll fade but right now i look like a carrot so i do have a plan for barnes again i have a plan guys actually i'm just gonna add this to my notion because i'm trying to figure out how notion works and i think it'll just be kind of like trial and error books to buy and i'm just gonna add a to-do list for now and then have it like that Number one, yours truly, still on the hunt for a good copy of that. The Crescent City, because they just have the special editions come out, so I want to grab those. And then I want to get the new Percy Jackson book. I don't know what- is it Chalice of the Gods? That's my goal for today. We'll see. And then we'll do a haul whenever I get home! We got it. We got the green one. This one's so pretty. I just think it's so nice. Just the perfect blue purple color, I love it. So I think this one was the one that actually like lost the poll. I think it was the least popular one, but I love it. I think it's so cute. So now I have two more. And then I have a white one too, which I can put stickers on now. I think if they have The Last Word by Taylor Adams, I wanna grab that because it's sold out everywhere all the time. And I think that would be a fun little October read. We made it! I got into a little bit of a road rage moment there. And then I remembered that I was going to Barnes & Noble, so 
I needed it to calm the heck down. But we're gonna go to Barnes because it's right enjoy and I said you too there's my bag of books I'll do a haul whenever I get home but I'll show you the cookies right now I got six because they were doing the four for six or six for four that's them these are huge I always forget how big they are sorry about that it's a while later now. <laughs> the Barnes & Noble haul, and then I also got a package from Amazon, so this is, I think this is probably the skirt. Okay, we got the skirt. Oh, it's, it's mini mini. It is mini and very stretchy. All right, now the book haul. I got six books and a fun little thing. First thing that I went in there for, and the most important, I am so excited to follow these characters again. I miss them. She's adorable. And it matches my Percy Jackson books because I have like the the new covers. Then we got Yours Truly by Abby Jimenez. This is the third book. What even are they? I picked up The Gilded Cage by Lynette Noni. This is the second book in the Present Haler trilogy. Have I read the first? No, but I saw it and my Barnes Noble didn't have it, so I picked it up. I'm getting back into my bad habit of buying the whole series when I don't need to. And then they did have The Last Word by Taylor Adams, so I've heard really amazing things and I'm excited to dive into this. It was expensive, so if I don't love this book, I'm gonna be pissed. I think it was, it was $30. The last two books that I got were these lovely, beautiful editions of the Crescent City book. They're just so pretty. Like, they're gorgeous. Those were all the books that I got. And then I've seen this a few times, so I wanted to grab it. These are the Anecdote Candles. Basically, it has like a trope or something like that. This one is Enemies to Lovers. It smells like heated fights and steamy nights. The actual scent is Vanilla Orchard and Jasmine. Did I say orchard? Vanilla Orchid. And jasmine i'm a vanilla girl through and through so but yeah so these were the the books that we grabbed did i need them no did i want them yes do i have room for them no but i did it anyway i think that's everything that i needed to haul for you guys no there's sticker residue i'm gonna cry stop it right now i will literally lose my noggin okay well i have to fix that now this one also has sticker residue. I hate when they put stickers on paper box because then it just, it doesn't work. I'm gonna get some editing done and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.